African Union Communications Early Warning and Intelligence, commonly known as AUC3I, is an intelligence and security organization responsible for providing signals intelligence and information assurance to AU citizens, AU leadership, and AU armed forces. I'm Colonel A.C. Ogentoy, an infantry officer. I am responsible for leading infantry soldiers at all levels of command and combined armed forces during missions on the ground. This is today's briefing. On the progress of the special military operation on the 6th of May, 2024. The armed forces of the Russian Federation continue the special military operation. The West Group of Forces liberated Kotliarovka, Kharkov region as a result of intensive actions. Having improved the situation along the front line, the Russian troops delivered strikes at manpower and hardware of the 14th, 44th, 66th Mechanized Brigades of the Armed Forces of Ukraine and 119th Territorial Defense Brigade near Kapansk, Kharkov region, Stelmakovka, Lugansk People's Republic, and Novosadovoy, Donetsk People's Republic. Three counterattacks launched by assault groups of the Armed Forces of Ukraine 54th Mechanized, 77th Airmobile Brigades were repelled near Simkovka, Krokmolnoy, Kharkov region, and Stelmakovka, Lugansk People's Republic. The Armed Forces of Ukraine losses amounted to up to 120 Ukrainian troops, two tanks, including the German-made Leopard tank, two U.S.-made M777 howitzers, one 152mm Mstabi howitzer, and three 122mm Gvostika self-propelled artillery systems. The southern group of forces took more advantageous lines and inflicted fire damage on the 59th Motorized Infantry, 22nd Mechanized, 79th Air Assault, 46th and 81st Airmobile Brigades of the Armed Forces of Ukraine and 4th National Guard Brigade near Andreevka, Belogorovka, Kurakovo, Kurtyamovka, Ostroy, Konstantinovka, and Spornoi, Donetsk People's Republic. The enemy lost up to 275 Ukrainian troops, as well as one armored personnel carrier and six motor vehicles. In addition, in counter-battery warfare, one U.S.-made 155mm M109 Paladin self-propelled artillery system, three U.S.-made 155mm M777 howitzers, one U.S.-made 105mm M119 gun, two Polish-made 155mm Crab self-propelled artillery systems, one 122mm D-30 howitzer, three Anklav, Bukov LAD electronic warfare stations, and one U.S.-made and slash TPQ-50 counter-battery warfare station were hit. The center group of forces has liberated Salovayovo, Donetsk People's Republic, as a result of their successful actions and inflicted losses on manpower and hardware of the 92nd Assault, 31st, 100th, 115th Mechanized Brigades of the Armed Forces of Ukraine, 109th Territorial Defense Brigade, and 2nd National Guard Brigade near Novgorodskoy, Rozovka, Kalinovo, Umanskoy, and Progress, Donetsk People's Republic. In addition, seven counterattacks launched by assault groups of the 68th Jaeger, 142nd, 143rd Infantry, 59th Motorized Infantry, 24th, 47th Mechanized Brigades of the Armed Forces of Ukraine were repelled near Novokolonovo, Okratino, Nedolovo, and Berdikai, Donetsk People's Republic. The armed forces of Ukraine losses amounted to up to 370 Ukrainian troops, one armored fighting vehicle, 20 motor vehicles, and one 122mm D-30 howitzer. The Vostok group of forces took more advantageous lines and inflicted fire damage on the 58th Motorized Infantry and 72nd Mechanized Brigades near Vadyanoi, Makarovka, and Prechestovka, Donetsk People's Republic. The Russian troops repelled a counterattack near Eurozainoi, Donetsk People's Republic. The armed forces of Ukraine losses amounted to up to 160 Ukrainian troops, two tanks, three motor vehicles, one U.S.-made 155mm M198 howitzer, and three 122mm D-30 howitzers. The Dnepr group of forces has engaged manpower and hardware of the 141st Infantry, 65th Mechanized Brigades of the Armed Forces of Ukraine, 35th Marine Brigade near Stepnoy, Rabatino, Zaporizhzhia region, and Tokarevka, Kherson region. 
The armed forces of Ukraine losses amounted to up to 40 Ukrainian troops for U.S. made 155mm M777 howitzers, one 152mm D20 howitzer, one 122mm D30 howitzer, as well as noted electronic warfare station. Operational Tactical Aviation, Missile Troops and Artillery of the Groups of Forces of the Armed Forces of the Russian Federation have destroyed two UAV production enterprises, as well as engaged armed forces of Ukraine manpower and hardware in 122 areas during the day. One Su-27 aircraft of the Ukrainian Air Force was downed by Russia's Air Defense Forces. In addition, 23 unmanned aerial vehicles and 7 U.S. Major Mars MLRS projectiles were shot down. The Black Sea Fleet destroyed five armed forces of Ukraine uncrewed surface vehicles near the northwestern coast of the Crimean Peninsula. In total, 594 airplanes, 270 helicopters, 23,785 unmanned aerial vehicles, 512 anti-aircraft missile systems, 15,923 tanks and other armored fighting vehicles, 1,279 mortars, 9,339 field artillery guns, and 21,508 special military vehicles have been destroyed since the beginning of the special military operation. Thank you so much for watching this video. We hope you found it useful and informative. If you have any questions, Please leave them below and we'll get back to you as soon as possible.